about talking about the second periods with uh, with Cam a little bit ago, and it's just it's been a problem that has really been occurring for you guys all season long. Is there anything that any common thread to any of that, uh, Oliver? Because that's where a lot of times you lose lose a grip on these games. Um, yeah, I'm not sure why um, we aren't playing better in the second. I mean, it's a mentality, right? So if you have a good first, you just gotta keep going that direction. For us, at this, uh, you know. Uh, we weren't really ready to play out there in a second. And so, got to, um, I don't know, straighten it up and uh, do more of the right things. You know, we know what those things are. We just got to do them. And, um, you know, I don't know. I think it's just a mindset. Yeah. He, he also said that as much time as you spend in the defensive zone trying to defend, it just kind of zaps your energy, energy rather going the other way, right? I mean, it starts there. So, we got to get the puck out the right way, win our battles. Um, you know, if we spend too much time in our own zone, we're going to when we get the final. So we got to straighten it out. And just personally for you playing in that bubble, what, what is that like for you? How, how much of a challenge is that for you to have that on? Uh, I, I'm not going to use that as an excuse. I mean, it's, it's different, but um, I'm able to see. So uh, yeah, I don't know. I'd rather not play with it, but it's, it's no excuse. Um, it shouldn't affect my game. Thanks, Alan. Okay, next we'll go to Brian Hedrick. Go ahead, Brian. Hey, Ali. Uh, sorry to keep asking about that, but we hadn't talked to you since the uh, the injury. Uh, it, did you – you wanted to wear the plastic shield uh, as opposed to the cage. Did you feel like you could see a little better? Uh, yeah, I mean, I don't know. I didn't really like the um, the cage, whatever, uh, during the game. I just wanted to try to, the class one, so feel a little bit better in that one. When, when's the last time you'd worn a cage? Uh, I don't know, 10 years ago. <laughs> I was going to say it had to be a long time. Did the plastic one find you at all or no? It was fine. It was, uh, no, didn't have any problems there. Was this the first time you had been hit in the face with a puck in your career or no? Um, yeah, like that. I mean, stitches, I think. Uh, I mean, a few smaller ones, but that was the, the bigger one. So. Yeah. Is that, I mean, that's just something that you have to deal with as a hockey player. You just kind of accept it. Yeah, it's a part of the game. It happens. It happens to a lot of guys. So it's, uh, it's what it is. Yeah. Uh, get, really quick, getting back to the second period there, you know, you, one of the problems you guys have had this year, obviously, is giving up multiple goals, like, quickly. Is that more of just a focus thing that you guys just kind of need to bear down and, and make sure a second or third goal doesn't go in? Yeah, we just lose a lot of momentum. And I think we make this bad place. So, um, I don't know. It's hard to give you a good answer. I mean, it's kind of simple. You got to make the right plays and if you can do it in the first period. There's no excuses for a second. I mean, we all know we're capable of making the right plays, um, but for us, it seems like it's uh, difficult to do in a full 60. So um, you know, we're not happy about it. Okay. Thank you. That's what we're going to adjust the vote. Go ahead, Jeff. Uh, thanks, Glenn. Uh, thanks, Ali. Just with kind of so many new faces in the lineup and so many kind of guys that you guys have leaned on for so long, not not in the lineup right now. Is it just tough to maybe kind of get that chemistry going with some guys? I know you ended up playing with a bunch of different guys tonight uh, as far as the line goes. Does that make it tough? Yeah, I mean, it's uh, a lot of guys coming in and so on. So, yeah, it's, it's different. I mean, uh, you look at our lineup, uh, I don't know, two two weeks ago, it's obviously different from now. So, it can be a challenge. I don't know. Um, we still need to be better and, you know, that's still not good enough. Yeah. You ended up playing with Dunn a lot in the third there. I mean, just initial thoughts on it. It seemed like he's a straightforward guy and, and really kind of clicked with you at least there for a little bit. You like what you see out of him so far? Yeah, I like it. Big body, skates well, um, you know, can handle the puck. I think he, uh, he makes the right place out there. So, um, yeah, it's a obviously exciting time for him to get some games and, you know, it's, uh, a uh, good time for him to show himself off. And I think he's uh, doing a lot of good things out there. Thanks, Ali.